Happy New Year everybody. Just making a video here to show you how you can train in a gym for all the events at Ringwood Strongest Man 2 Mad Max Wraps. So first up you have the car pull. So there'll be a car behind you. You've got a harness for additional weight. We're going to add a sled as well. So there'll be a rope in my hands also on the day. Now I'll train it in the gym. So here's one way you can train a going, carpool man. in a gym. You can get a sled behind you and just for a counterweight so it don't fall over, you can just get a trailer in front and just uh, push both of those. Here I'm doing about 300 kilograms, quite heavy and slow. You might want to go a little lighter, shorter steps, faster steps. If you have a fixed anchored rope in the gym, you could hold on to that and just use the sled only. Um, either of those variations, both going to get the same sort of training effect. Next up is the Kundalini car hold. Now, if you're not cultured, Kundalini is a character in Mad Max 1 who throws a chain at a car, gets his hand ripped off. So basically, the cars on the day will be reversed up to a ramp to make the back of it a little heavier. Yeah. Sort of make the car roll down and you're holding the car from rolling down. Now, in the gym, you could get a cable machine hold on to an anchor point, one arm is where the weight is holding you down, so right here on the life in this machine, the weight stack is 95 kilos, so I can just Jimmy. hold that out, arms extended for a period of time, train your grip strength, you can just do bare grip barbell training, barbell rows, axle holds, shrugs, all those sort of things is going to help bring up your grip, pretty easy one, just hold as long as you can. Up next here is the car deadlift. So in competition, it's going to look like this, handles to the side, 14 inches high, max reps you can. Obviously we're using much cooler cars because uh, that's how we do it in Australia, these V8s, Ford Falcons. So here's me in the gym just showing you the height. So basically if you get a trap bar deadlift on blocks or a bumper plate, it's going to be the right height using the high handles. For reference, 14 inches is the same size of this ABC 10 kilogram plate. So if you have a 10 kilogram ABC plate in your gym, you can use that for reference there. So the middle of the handle is the height of the plate, perfect. So just train trap bar deadlift and you'll be ready for the deadlift event. Pretty much the same thing. Pretty accessible equipment, most gyms have. This is the Fit Tech one, which is brilliant. Next event is going to be the Axle Clean and Press. Obviously the Ford Falcon's known for its legendary 9-inch diff which ends up in many Holdens, so keep with the car theme. We're going to have a Axle Clean and Press. Pretty simple. Press as many reps as you can in a minute. Now if you've got a gym that's got an Axle Bar, perfect, just use that, some bumper plates. Each rep from the ground, give it a clean and press it. Here's Jess just doing a few reps, only just learning this a few weeks ago. Just taking your time, just getting those reps done and complete. Now, if you haven't got access to a axle bar, that's okay. Next best thing would just be to get some fat grips, chuck those on a bar, so therefore you've got the required grip strength to lift up the weight. Um, 50 millimeter is the size of an axle bar. If not, clean and press of a bar is gonna be your next best thing you can do. So I hope this video has helped you all out on how to train in a commercial gym or another gym that hasn't got all the equipment for this strongman comp i chose the event specifically because you should be able to train all the events quite easily anywhere you are in, in any gym so therefore on the day you can rock up deadlift some cool cars and have some fun so look forward to seeing you all there uh february 5 take care